Has anyone ever told you that you twirl your hair too much or fidget a lot? These little things you do are some of the more common habits of people with anxiety. While there are common habits, anxiety can manifest in more ways than one. So with that said, here are six anxious habits that don't get enough attention. Number one, you obsessively control things. Do you constantly find yourself triple checking your plans or are you always making sure that everything's okay? People with anxiety feel an impending sense of doom. They have this inescapable feeling that things can go terribly wrong at any moment. And to prevent that, they try to regain control of things by obsessively making sure things are the way they're supposed to be. Number two, you get bored too easily. Do you feel like you can't connect with others or that conversations with people are boring more often than not? Anxious people tend to have difficulty concentrating. They could be so in their minds that they actually fail to listen and engage with other people in a fun and meaningful way. You may find yourself getting out of a conversation and feeling negative about it. But ask yourself, were you fully engaged with the other person or were you thinking about how you were coming across instead? Number three, you over apologize. Do you find yourself saying sorry, even for the simplest things such as before asking a question or when you do something on behalf of someone else? Anxious people may feel guilty for things that aren't their fault. Excessively apologizing may feel like a natural thing to do the more you do it, but doing so can be harmful to your self-esteem in the long run. The next time you catch yourself about to say sorry for something, ask yourself whether it's really necessary. Don't beat yourself up for it if you do blurt it out, but try to be a bit more observant of your response and examine whether it's really necessary to apologize. Number four, you have trouble sleeping at night. Do you spend hours ruminating about the bad moments of your day or even from years ago? Anxious people tend to retain a sense of mental alertness marked by worry before falling asleep. These individuals are prone to hypervigilance throughout the night, causing them to sleep a lot less than they should. And if that's not enough, these insomniac tendencies can exacerbate feelings of anxiety and other mood disorders during the day as well. Number five, you use your phone as a crutch. Do you find yourself mindlessly scrolling through your phone during breaks in conversation? Anxious people often take out their phones as a coping mechanism to engage attention away from negative thoughts. You may feel unsure about how to deal with certain situations and use your phone as a crutch. It can be hard to disconnect yourself from your phone when you need to especially as phones are integrated into our everyday lives. However, you may feel more alert throughout conversations and add value to them if you gradually decrease your phone time. And number six, talking too much. Freezing up in conversation can be a clear sign of anxiety, sure, but talking too much? Surprisingly, this habit can be a sign too. Anxious people often talk more to fill the perceived silence. They wanna add value and avoid awkwardness, but it often stems from a place of nervousness and insecurity rather than authenticity and general inquiry. Closing thoughts. There is no shame in having anxiety. The important thing is that you recognize the habits so you can learn from them and grow. Do you relate to any of the signs above? Do you have any more signs that you think would fit this description? If so, share them in the comments below and remember to like and share this video with people who could benefit. As always, the references and studies are listed in the description. Until next time, friends, thanks for watching.